Salutations, everybody. All right, so I'm starting off with my toner water. It's rose water. I'm using that all over my face. Now I'm taking my rose gold elixir by Farsali, my favorite moisturizer. It feels so good on the skin, especially with my makeup application. Next, I'm taking Anastasia Beverly Hills in dark brown. I'm using their brush as well. I'm grooming the eyebrows first. I'm starting three, four quarters of the way. I'm beginning to shape my eyebrows. I'm sculpting the tail end of it. And then three, four quarters of the way in, sculpting the top of my eyebrow as well. I check both sides. And now I'm taking my NYX concealer in a flat brush. Starting at the beginning, I'm beginning to conceal my eyebrow. Taking care of that shape, really sculpting it and perfecting my eyebrow. Three fourth quarters of the way in, doing the same thing, just sculpting everything, perfecting the eyebrow. And now blending just my favorite part because once my eyebrows are all blended out everything looks so good so blending the top as well and the other side next I'm taking the Farsali unicorn essence putting that all over my face and then just blending that all in it's gonna make everything stick especially my foundation so I'm taking chai by bare minerals and my liquid illuminator by NYX and I'm blending out my concealer by LA Colors. It's a color corrector for the dark spots. And then I'm blending the chai mixed with the NYX Illuminator. Blending it on my five head and blending everything out. Next, I'm taking the NARS concealer. This is caramel. So I'm putting that under my eyes, my forehead down my nose and on my chin so this is just gonna lighten those spots so I'm taking that rose water put it on a beauty blending um, sponge <laughs> and blending it out so I'm blending gonna blend both sides and my forehead as well just want to make sure you blend everything out so I'm taking the Kat Von D this is her loose pigment and I'm putting that under my eyes you really have to be careful <laughs> with this loose foundation because it just can fall everywhere like on my nose see there and then I'm taking caramel ruby kisses putting that on my nose and around my face and while I'm doing that, I'm also going to blend out that Kat Von D foundation as well. You want to make sure you really be careful and blend everything in and blend everything out. So I'm taking LA Colors Rose Eyeshadow Palette. It comes with like the sponge applicator. Most people throw it away, but you can still use it. So I'm taking a black eyeliner and I'm going to do a smoky eye look so you don't have to be perfect at this part just putting this on the end and you can use your finger or you can use the sponge applicator to blend this part out so I chose to use the sponge applicator because I have nails so it makes everything easier so you just want to blend that out again it doesn't have to be perfect but it looks right now. So I'm taking this cranberry color and I'm putting this right above that black part in the crease and towards the front. I'm taking this light color and I'm gonna use this right under my eyebrow to lighten it, make everything pop. I'm using this color to blend, continue to blend everything together. 
and taking that darker color and now I'm putting that on top of the black that we had put earlier and you want to pack that right on the outer corner and then begin to blend it out this part you must continue to blend so there's no harsh lines as you can see here some harsh lines so I'm gonna begin to blend all of that out and just blend 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 And I'm also going to take that same color, put it right under my eyes, and smudge it out. And now I'm taking the Kat Von D eyeliner. I'm starting from the beginning, beginning to line the eye. I love this eyeliner. It makes everything so much easier. So if you're better at eyeliner, get this Kat Von D eyeliner. It basically does the job for you. Just have to have a bit of a steady hand, but got this. Now I'm taking the NYX <laughs> glitter, and this is like the glitter glue. I'm putting this in the tear ducts, beginning parts. Taking the sponge applicator makes everything easier, and just dabbing that on, and then putting the loose pigment glitter on top of that glue. And it makes it last literally all day. Some of the glitter got on me, so I blended it out. This is the NYX White Eyeliner. You really have to be careful with this, because not only do you have to have a steady hand, you have to have everything steady. And I'm putting this right above the black eyeliner. right above just very precisely very carefully now you see that I made some mistakes but there's no problem because we're gonna go back with the Kat Von D liner and clean it up right under that part so if you make any mistakes no worries we can fix it so I'm taking my NYX Liquid Illuminator again, putting it on my nose and on my high cheekbones, blending it out, and taking my Strobe and Glow Highlighter Palette, I'm using the beginning color, I'm putting that on my high cheekbones and my nose. And I'm also extra, so I'm putting it on my lips as well. <laughs> So I'm taking Club Hopper by NYX and lining my lips with that. It's a liquid suede color. I love it. It's so feels so good on the lips. It doesn't make everything so dry. So I'm continuing to line it. And now I'm taking the Nicki Minaj Pink Print by MAC. Filling in the rest of my color on the inside of my lips. Mashing that together, make sure you blend it well. And it just makes this beautiful ombre. So I'm taking All Nighter by Urban Decay, spraying that all over. And taking my Better Than Sex mascara. Putting it on my lashes. And my bottom lashes as well. This mascara is so good. I'm gonna line my eyes again. And basically this is the finished look taking my hair down and by the way this scarf is from lush it's so cute so I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial <laughs> make sure you like comment subscribe thank you for my former subscribers I love you guys and let me know any looks you want to for me to do I'm so excited. This look was so fun. You guys have a good day.